Hey, this is Harlan with a final exam tip. Tell your final exam story as if it's already happened. Now, I've given you other examples of how to tell your story as if it's happened, and the idea is you want to leapfrog all of the fear and anxiety and the things that make you all stressed out, and you want to go to the happy place. You want to go to the place where it feels so good. So in your brain, you actually close your eyes and you feel what it's like to be at the last day after the last exam, and you feel a sense of relief, and you feel a sense of calm because you did everything everything in your power to get the best grade possible. You went to office hours, you talked to your professors, you formed study groups, you asked other students how to uh, do the best you can do, you got good sleep, you were balanced. You should feel so proud and so good because you did it. You made it. That's what I mean by telling your story as if it's happened. And once you tell that story, then you actually do the things that made you feel so good. The opposite is to be like, oh, I'm so overwhelmed, I'm so afraid, I'm so scared. And then to get all caught up in all the anxiety, which doesn't do anything, it's just wasted energy. So tell your story as if it's happened, and then create it, and you have a much better chance of it happening. And you know what, no matter what happens, you're gonna feel much better about the whole experience.